It's a little oasis, the London wetlands, a mosaic of lagoons, reed beds and meadows, only a few minutes from the heart of the capital. It's a snapshot of a natural environment that, according to today's report, is increasingly under threat. A stark warning that two-thirds of common plants and half the animals and birds of the planet could see a dramatic decline this century due to climate change. Plants, reptiles and amphibians are expected to be at highest risk. Sub-Saharan Africa, Central America, Amazonia and Australia would lose the most species of plants and animals. And a major loss of plant species is projected in North Africa, Central Asia and Southeastern Europe. The authors of the report say they were shocked by the findings. But I don't think any of us had expected so many common species to have such large projected range losses. So I would say that actually the results are more significant than we expected. Already the movement of migrating birds is beginning to be adversely affected by the change in climate. It could prove extremely damaging because those birds traditionally have wintered in sites where they're protected, nature reserves and large wild areas, but now they could be moving to areas where they might be hunted, where there might be less food and where we're less able to monitor them. And if we fail to act on global warming, well in the future we'll live on a planet where increasingly nature will only be found by visiting reserves like this. Peter Sharp, Al Jazeera.